Hey Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This is the current feelings of your person that are reading session for you Aquarius. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good, okay? This reading for today is for the Aquarius friends out there. What can I get for Aquarius, please? What is the love message that is meant for you to know, ready for you to know? This is the current feelings of your person. What can I get for Aquarius, please, okay? Before I start, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you for your support. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell. And if you would like to further connect with me, all of the merchandise, the private reading, extended reading, it's down the description box below, okay? If you want to know about the services and the merchandise that we offer, we have summarized the link down the description box below, including the new moon, the full moon, and the astro astrology for this month. I'm struggling with letter R. Okay. Okay. All right. So let's start your reading. What's the current feelings of your person? First reading is you've got the four of wands in reverse. The queen of wands. They're ignoring you. <laughs> Six of wands. Um, someone is ignoring you. Yeah. Um, could be an Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius energy in here. I mean, they're still interested with you. If you feel like you're being neglected or if you feel like they're setting you aside, I feel like this person is quite busy. It's not intentional. They're ignoring you because they've got other stuff to do. They've got to-dos. But you're still close. You know? They still think about you, but it's not... They could not concentrate because they've got other things to do. If you feel like you're being ignored... Um, it's intentional, but I guess, but it's more of, yeah, I, I, it's my intention to ignore you because I'm busy. Yeah, dedication, eight of disc, look at that, eight of disc or eight of pentacles. They're working on something, so don't, don't, please don't be offended, something like that. Don't, don't be offended. They've got some things that they need to prioritize. You might feel neglected or set aside. It's just this one needs to proceed. Okay? Something that they're doing that needs urgent attention. Okay? So let go of the worries. They're busy at work or business. Okay? All right. Next reading is oh, someone is pregnant. Queen of Disc. You've got the Ten of Pentacles. You have some good news. Um, you, you know, for some of you, someone is pregnant. It could be you or it could be the person that you're dealing with. But someone is pregnant and that pregnancy will secure your relationship. Like this looks like an egg. Someone is pregnant and the pregnancy will secure your relationship. And someone is going to give birth to a beautiful news. I think it's a pregnancy. And their current feelings to you is that they won't tell you right away. But they will surprise you. Um, I feel like this is applicable for Aquarius male. Your person is pregnant. Surprisingly, they will tell you after two, three weeks. Surprisingly. Yeah, it's quite unusual. But I pick it up. I'm a, just a, you know, messenger. Next reading, this is definitely an X. So the next one, the current feelings, um, is an X. And you've got your harmony. Wow. Then, then. The high priestess. Wow. So the current feelings, I feel like this is two person. This is different energy. This is a different energy. And I feel like this is your manifestation. So for some of you guys... The current feelings of your person is that they will be happy if you leave the third party. Or the if the third party is gone, you will be happy. That's the manifestation. It's like this is Ten of Swords, the end of all the problem. The end of all the problems that you have is the third party. When that ends, you will be happy. There is something about third party that it could end. And it is both in your power and in their power to end the third party. And you could really, you know, live happily ever after. Just like what you manifested. Because this is the end. Ten of Swords. There is an ending of something. 
and a beginning between you and your person. And this is what they have been manifesting. Like a black and white. Mm. Okay, that's interesting. Okay. All right, let's pick up more intuitive message. It's kind of a little bit everywhere in like... Sorry, a little bit all over your reading. Okay, let's pick up more intuitive message for you, Aquarius. The lover's card in reverse. Four. So this is two. This is four, but it looks like two. And the strength card. Four of swords. Meditation, four of cups, four and four. I feel like this is a situation right now. You know, this is the current feelings of your person if you're dealing with someone right now or someone you're dating. It could also be an ex. Um, they could not decide because there's a lot of factors to consider. I feel like they keep changing their mind. But one day, this person will be able to decide. The right time will come that your person will decide. Because I'm seeing in here like bullseye. You know, it looks like one day all of you and their energy and time and alignment and schedule um it's just gonna synchronize and it will click so you could be dealing some with someone right now you could be dating someone right now it could be on and off there's some sort of challenge you could be dealing with an ex or you could be in a relationship right now um it's, it's more of play it safe there would be a right time a right moment where your person is gonna tell you all or your person is gonna decide a commitment or not a commitment you know it's it's the right time or it's the right moment and i feel like it's coming it looks like a radar you know it's like in the ship it's this is big and it's getting smaller and smaller and you're getting closer and closer to that point to the middle point where someone can decide or will decide yeah okay all right, so let's pick up more intuitive message for you. What's the current feelings of your person? What is the current feelings of your person? This is for Aquarius. What's the current feelings of your person? You've got the five of pentacles. And you've got the, this is the four of pentacles. Wow, four and five. You've got to, you've got to leave someone or they have to leave the magician card. And six of pentacles so the current feelings of your person if you're dealing with someone right now or someone you're dating or it could be an ex it's that it's impossible to leave things open you need to have an ending you know um i feel like your person if they are quiet okay if if your person is quiet um i feel like it's more of both of you it's it will, I'm getting the word unattended. It won't, um, right now it's feeling like unattended. Like your person is unattended and not available, not participating, not connecting. But they cannot leave the situation unattended. At some point, they will restore balance and they will have to get back to you with something. And, you know, I feel like there's two hands and... There's a lot to catch up. I feel like this is for, you know, temporary goodbye and then release and then not really interested. And then they will pick up the pieces of information where you left off and you would start to communicate again. Like it's it's a person or it's a, your personal current. It's the feelings of your person is that nah, it's too complicated. It's too it's too hot. It's too complicated. So let me just lay low. I'll come back. Okay? So it's 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 cooling off. It's a cooling off period. Okay? So this is your reading. Thank you very much for tuning in. Thanks for being here. I hope you like the reading. I hope you have connected with me. If you do, click the bell, click subscribe. All other details about the channel, private reading, extended reading, and the um, 100 Days Gratitude Journal. We have, I think, uploaded a teaser about it. Thank you, thank you for those who have ordered. My team has informed me that we have a couple, uh, well, a lot, a lot of orders in the pipeline. So thank you in advance, and I will see you soon again, guys. Bye-bye.